Hey everybody, Prepper Nurse One here. Um, just want to do a quick video showing you what we're pulling more wood out of here today. So we got uh, my stepfather's back of his truck all loaded up. Um, Alright, you can close it up and lock it up there. And uh, so he's more of a professional, so we did an assessment on the building. We did bring up the, the window and the door and the screen and the other wheelbarrow, which is now here. Um, and basically it would be a waste of money to put money into this building. So basically this is strictly going to be for storage. Um, what he suggested is that, uh, I button up the camper and, uh, you know, put some, um, even if I just get bales of, uh, straw around the bottom and, uh, you know, if we had to tough it out, just keep, you know, stay in the camper which kind of makes more sense. Um, if it's middle of winter, we'll deal with what we have to deal with. But uh, for right now, um, for right now, like I said, the building itself is basically just gonna be for storage. Um, what I may do, I think what we're gonna try to do here is I'm gonna pull the camper up more this way um, I have the awning inside the building, so what I might try to do is get the awning put up, and in this way I have a extra area, and then button that up, and in this way we can have, you know, another way of coming in and having a bigger area so that we can put stuff out in there as well. So I think that's the route we're going to go. Um, it, it just makes more sense to wait and put the money in the spring into building up in the spot where I want to build. It just, uh, it's, it's, it's a better way to go. It's just not worth the waste of time to put money into this building. So what I'm going to do, I still plan on utilizing this space, um, but I'm going to focus in the spring on building something up here. And once that's built, I'll probably end up tearing this building down and building something in this area more over this way though. So now it'll be off the other property. Um, and then this way I have something over here as well for like a, you know, a garage storage type of area. And uh, so that's what we're going to do with that. Um, you know, I, I, I wanted to have somebody that knew what they were talking about come up here and look at everything. So, hey, Lair. Huh? Forgot about the tire. Uh, Your tire? Oh. Oh, we just on top. Okay. Um, so that's... Uh, it's, uh, today is, actually, we ended up coming up here, it's Friday, October 10th, and, uh, so it's a beautiful day. I mean, it's, uh, but the, definitely the leaves are all changing, and it's that time of year, so we're going to take this load of wood back with us when we go, and, uh, I'm going to probably come back up tomorrow just to do some work. I'm probably just going to cut some wood tomorrow. I may actually start in on that stuff there. There's another spot, too, that I can work on um that i might work on that so that's going to be it for right now um so the building we're not gonna worry about trying to save it because it's just too far gone so we are we got the uh you can see the doors over there and the other door is there so we got those in here now and in the, in the windows in the center so those are in place um and also, like I said, we got the wheelbarrow up here. So, so that's going to be it. Uh, I just kind of wanted to have him come up here and give me his opinion, and I value what he says. So, I'm definitely not going to waste money putting money into something that uh, is going to just eat it up. He, like he said, rather start fresh, put the pylons in in the spring up over there, where I want to build my building anyway, and focus on that in the spring. So I'll have. Uh, Bill come in and flatten that out for me and uh, We'll go from there and so but uh, Like I said those those projects may have to wait to the spring, but uh, that's okay So I just focus on working on the camper getting that buttoned up um, get the awning put up on it and uh, We'll go from there. All right, so uh, prepper nurse one off